This federal government has always recognized that uh, to make a partnership with us in British Columbia means trust us, we'll deliver. And each time we've done that with the federal, this federal government, we have been successful because we work together to create housing solutions. And by blending it into our own flexibility, we can do some pretty remarkable things. When the partners come together, you get the Sorella, which will give women and children a safe place to call home within the city of Vancouver. It will allow women who are expecting children to be able to keep those children because their lives will be stabilized and their children will not end up in care. That's a big, big plus. Not just for the women, but for the families and for those children long term in British Columbia. We are here to celebrate two very important announcements. First, we are officially opening the Sorella Project, a new building which provides 108 units of supportive housing for women and is helping to revitalize Vancouver's downtown east side. As well, the governments of Canada and British Columbia will sign a partnership agreement under a new affordable housing framework to fund affordable housing programs over the next three years as we continue to work together to reduce the number of people in housing need. The need for this project was apparent and the outcome, as you can see, is outstanding. Sorella will be a special home for so many women and, as the Mayor said, so many children as well. The support of the province, the city and the federal government was critical to the success of this project. Minister Rich Coleman has been a tremendous leader in his efforts to end homelessness. He has garnered support from all areas and this is what makes it happen, not only in Vancouver, but right across the province. It's more than just housing. And it always is when we have these announcements. Because it will help women regain confidence and independence, build a better future for themselves and their children. But it always, what, these, what housing is all about, and I've always said and you've heard it, it's not about the bricks and mortar. And it's not about just the ribbon cutting. It's about the heart that goes into the building with organizations like Atira who step up to the plate and manage and bring the supports together to make these things work.